Greetings YouTube, DJ Bonebreaker coming at you for a quick and dirty settlement build here at the Red Rocket Truck Stop outside of Sanctuary. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So yeah, as you can see, got the uh, Red Rocket Truck Stop built up here. We have, hey, after this, uh, Brahman tipping. I think, two artillery emplacements. And over by this little entrance here, we've got a uh, caravan trade post hey, with uh, Lucas Miller work. stopping in to visit. Got our guard dog kennels here. Power plant plus the living quarters for two people right here. Got their bathroom and everything in it. Yeah, ignore the uh, weed sticking up through the floor, but. Unfortunately, you know, you kind of got to deal with that. But yeah, I got our fusion generator here. Vault Tech population management system here. And a few other, you know, like odds and ends for like, you know, control consoles and what have you. We got a Brahmin here. This Brahmin just showed up randomly one day. So I'll put a feeding trough here so that way it'd be kind of out of the way. Got our uh, water source right here, two water pumps. And then I built this um, restaurant right here, which also has two apartments above the uh, restaurant. As you can see, our guards like to hang out at the soda fountain. <laughs> but yeah, so you got the arcade machine, plenty of seating, our bar keep slash uh, cook, more seating over here. Maybe I'll get another nice drink. public restaurant you know, right here. They've got these special protectrons that, well, you know, maybe we'll talk about it some other time. And of course, back here, we've got our stove and sink and counters and stuff and menu. If you work, you eat. It's a and then up here, we've got laundry area, shared bathroom for the two this apartments up here. And this apartment here has two people. You know where you can get it. any jet? Just it's a bunk bed for a friend. And all their furniture. Little like living room and kitchen area over here. And similar layout for this other apartment up here as well. Not a bad job manning the soda fountain. And hey, over after here, this, we've got one of our small crop farms with some additional farm plots over here with uh, mostly meat fruit. Has enough food for, I believe, 18 nice. food is produced at this settlement. Got this small house over here. Which has a you know nice little kitchen on this side. Just asking for a friend. The little, you know, washer dryer combo right here. Living room slash bedroom right here and their bathroom right here. Similar layout, I guess, to the uh, power plant. But, you know, it's got a nice porch here on the side. Another one of our defensive platforms over here. The second artillery uh, platform right here. And then we've got another small cabin for two you people know, I heard right Vegas, here. They've got these special protectrons which that, has all well, the uh, you know, amenities maybe we'll talk about it some other time. of one of my typical small cabins. And then we've got, uh, like I said, we've got two guard posts. One right here and one over here. Got some chickens and rabbits running around. And as for the red rocket itself, as you can see, I've added some, you know, fixed up. You know, the other day I was in Diamond City and I met a guy named Todd Howard. 
Said he was working on some as kind well of as added to the outside of the building. What a weirdo! I uh, turned the garage into a weapons shop. So you got our weapons merchant right here. Kept most of the furniture intact and in place. Got a outcast T45 uh, power armor over here. You know, I hear radiation wiped out all the spiders. With plenty of weapons on display. Still got the armor workbench over here. One of these days we're going to walk right into one of their webs. And the uh, weapons workbench over here. Did add some additional lighting in. And then over here, I've uh, turned the uh, original Red Rocket. You know, I hear radiation wiped out all the spiders. Area into a general merchant thing. store. One of these days, we're gonna walk right into one of their webs. Third general merchant right here. All the soda you can drink. And then the ham radio for alerting radio freedom of any troubles right here, which I think this ham radio might have been here with the original settlement. Which is convenient. I did put in this wall from this and door you know, from I heard snappy Vegas, house got kits special and protector the, well, that, the doors from settlement. Well, you know, maybe we'll talk about it some other settlements time. expanded mod to add in this little bathroom here, and then I turn this office into a bedroom for two people. So yeah, that's. Uh, the entirety of the Red Rocket truck stop settlement build. I'm pleased with the fact I managed to squeeze uh, enough housing and, and occupation for 12 people in this small little tiny settlement. And I actually got it done shortly before I defeated the Institute. But I was, wanted to get those videos uploaded first. Anyways. Next videos I'll be uploading are some travel videos, but I'll try to be uploading some more Fallout videos over the next week or two. But until then, this is DJ Bonebreaker signing off.